Hey YouTube, it is Easy Prepper 101, and today I'm actually going to show you something that I got because I wanted to kind of learn a little bit on lock picking, and that is the Violent Nomad. This is their lock picking set, and on their website, this goes for around $16.99. This does sell out, but you can get other ones just like that that doesn't say the Violent Nomad. This is uh, by Clint Emerson. This is part of his brand. Um, I got this because I just really was just kind of interested in lock picking because Clint's got videos that talk about lock picking. And um, to kind of just show you this, get my hand around here, how you pull this out is it's very compact, very small, like a knife. So, I mean, if you can see in my hand, it's it's small. So this will fit in your pocket. And how um, you have an attachable piece, which is right here, and all you do is you just yank that out. So this is what you actually use to on this plastic lock which i bought separately and i'm probably doing this wrong but you turn this when you're actually picking putting the lock in to open this up but we'll get into this a little bit so to really then open it up you just adjust this knob and then you just pick whichever one that you're gonna that you're gonna get now just for reference i am not a locksmith i'm not a professional lock picker um i've ordered a um a book online that you can get off Amazon just for, you know like the basic for beginners and stuff like that uh, because the mostly I would just want to have this for in case if you know if you're locked outside of your house to use it that way or like if you're in your garage just what you can need or if you actually have a padlock if you got kids you can just quickly open it up in that so that's kind of the main reasons why I got this is just for the emergency situation sorry I took that off camera and that's the reason why I got that now what I ended up buying Buying separately was this plastic lock now they come in all different sizes there's different ones and it actually shows you as you, when I turn this here the different I'm gonna use this tool here that these will move up and down because this mechanism is what locks this so when you put your key in this will then open it up so that's what this is do is to kind of help guide you and train you now there's videos out there that kind of there's people that teach you how to do this so i'm i'm you can go look that way or go online um but i'm going to uh, pause this video and kind of show you how this actually works with the lock picking so i'm going to be honest when i got this i had to wait on this um from amazon for a little bit because it was just out of stock and the, the price was right for it so i had to wait for you know, learning how to kind of practice with the lock pick. And after watching some videos and reading about how to pick locks or whatever, and I'm still learning and I'm, you know, people, if, you, if I'm doing something wrong, you know, please be polite in the comments saying, hey, watch this, recommend some videos or some articles, you know, that maybe kind of help because like I said, this is just for emergency situation. So when you open it, when you put this uh, lock in here, the very bottom here is where the key is. This is where you're gonna wanna put this that piece in there and then so then you i what i've been from the videos i watch is i use my thumb to kind of put the tension on this so what we're going to do here is i'm going to try to bring this here so if we can maybe focus in on this i've gotten pretty good at practicing that i can kind of get this real quick and you see you know couple seconds or whatever now there's probably people that can do it way quicker than that i am still a beginner but for me to use this just for an emergency situation but what we can do here is i'm going to um close this back up and then i'm just going to take this piece out and if the camera can um focus in on this right here on these little um adapters or the the pins that's what helps it lock so when you put this in there you, you, do you see them moving just so slightly? That is, you know, when, when you're, when you have the other piece in there to crank it, that it helps unlock it up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this one more time so you can see what I'm talking about, that there's little holes. See, and, and like I said, I'm still new at this. I'm So if the camera can see those little holes right there, that is what that locks the, um, the stuff in there. That's what actually locks the, those little pins that go up and down. 
So that's what makes your lock. So when I release it, that that is kind of like your your combination. I don't know the technical terminology and details. I'm like I said, I'm still learning. But that is what when you put that key in to turn it. Now, when you do buy these locks, they come with keys or whatever. But I just sat at the table for about 15 minutes watching reads from videos. And within a, probably within about 15 to 20 minutes after watching videos, kind of demoing along with them, I was able to kind of pick this up, you know, very quickly and, you know, feeling pretty good about myself of, you know, getting it, you know. And they also, one, one of the guys on YouTube says, you need to find what tool works good for you. Right now for doing the practice lock, um, this one works well. Now, I actually worked on trying to get like my inside of the door. Um, I actually spent like 30 minutes and I got it one time. So I'm not gonna, you know, do that or whatever, but I actually got it one time and I was super excited. I, you found like, you probably, my wife thought I probably won the Stanley Cup or the NFL because I was so excited that I got the one because you you, you kind of get your mind into this, but it kind of trains you for that. But um, but to do that, you know, that's just going to take practice over time and time again. But in the end, um, I'm kind of excited about having this new little tool to have and to practice to have just in case if I need to get into my house or, you know, or a lock or something if a friend needs it or whatever. But in the end, like I'm not a lock picking person. I don't, you know, it don't buy one of these to steal and stuff that is wrong. You know, be right, do right by society. You know, we as preppers and stuff out there and, and people just in nature, we want to be good people. We want to be there to help people. So if you can be that person that who has done the practicing, the reading and is able to do this and you're able to help people be that good of a person. So um, anyone can buy these on Clint's website. This one that has the his uh, Violent Nomad on there. You can go to Amazon and buy these that doesn't have any um, um, writing on there. So. But that's going to be the end of this video. You know, kind of let me know what you guys think. If, you know, if you guys have ever tried to, you know, learn how to pick locks or how to, you know, read books, if you've attempted it or not. Um, you know, if you have any suggestions on books or, you know, or DVDs or stuff, you know, to help my education. Um, I found a few things online that I'm still, uh, I'm reading in that. You know, write those in the comment section. Um, I would really appreciate it. Um, hit that uh, thumbs up if you like this video. And if you haven't, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much. We will catch you guys down the road.